Hey, Ron, thank you. Now to the crisis at the U.S. border with Mexico, a point of political contention for years. But today, compared to a year ago, the border looks a whole lot different, much more activity. And our Katia Uriarte traveled to the valley to Hidalgo County to ride along with authorities to show us what they see on a daily basis. Earlier today, I found out that yesterday they had about a thousand people that crossed over in the Hidalgo area. And that's throughout the whole day. So the people that you see over there, those cars, you're saying a lot of them pretend to be maybe fishing, but really a lot of them are scouts? Some of those cars out there, those people are just scouting the area. They're looking over to see who's working, what's going on on this side. They know, they, uh, that's what they do. They do it every day, all day long. Um, and they report whatever's going on on this side. Uh, it's kind of like they'll give them the green light as to, hey, this area is open or, you know, nobody's working this area and then they start doing what they do. Hundreds of undocumented immigrants crossing the border in that one little sector alone. Akati Uriate will bring us more from the border in a special report tomorrow night on Chris 6 News at 10.